Let's keep it going. Yeah, wrong DMV, they gunning at you, man. You seem to be like, um, you seem to be one of the favorites so far on Night Court. You smacking black. Y'all tend, uh, tend to be one of the favorites on Night Court. Another case is slapped up against you, man. This time, this case is slapped up against you, was brought up against you by a brother named Jay Spoon. Jay Spoon believes you are a cancer to battle rap, he says. Jay Spoon says you are being charged with attempted murder. He He's slapping a citizen arrest on you for attempted murder. You tried to murder the battle rap gang with all your lies, with all your biasness, with all your deception. This is what this brother said. This brother said you are a URL representative when it comes to blogging. You are against any other battle league other than a URL. You've been sabotaging and trying to destroy RBE from the moment it announced Mook and Verb. You continue to go after them and other battle leagues, anything that's uh, 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 in competition with the URL. They said that you also is against the top tiers, just like you try to elevate the PGs over them, just like you tried to say that Chef Treads and Ryder was better than Surf and uh, uh, Big T. They believe that your word can't be trusted, your media can't be trusted, and that you're very biased towards anything that 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 uh that's either close with you or you're affiliated to. No goonies can do wrong in your eyes, neither can they lose battles. And um they believe you tried to murder the battle rap game. You tried to kill it and destroy it. Destroy it under the uh influence and uh itinerary. Of the URL. That's what they saying. I'm just reporting the news as it goes. That's exactly what they said. Now, is there any truth to this? I believe it is some truth to this. When I hear you saying things about RBE, I question myself like, man, why are you going hard at RBE? But you don't really speak about certain things that the URL doing that's against. Other leads, other leads. You speak about when other leads mess up, but you're not really speaking that much on when URL messing up or when they on some shiny stuff. You're not really addressing that. So I can see what Jay Spoon mean on that. I can see what he mean when it comes to the battlers, that you buy it towards a lot of the uh, top tier battle rappers, but yet you show a lot of honor and reverence to the mid tier, not mid tier, to the uh, PGs and things like that. So I definitely see his argument there. I definitely see the argument when it comes to like um, the media platforms. And uh, like I said, the URL Battle League, man. I see a lot of the things Jay Boom may be saying that you may be guilty of, brother. Now, what's my take on this? Like I said, I can see where they coming from. But I'm just going to give it to you in the raw. Um... Rome is on record saying he a biased battle rap blogging. Again, I got to tell the truth. People, whoever rock with him, rock with him because they like whatever he bringing to the table. Just like the same for me. Um, do I trust this media to some degree? Some things he do say truthful. Some things he do say based upon his personal feelings and his biasness. But some of the things he say, I know to be true. Some of the things he say that he think is true, I know to be false. So, yeah, it's a middle ground between both of those things, man. I think he very uh, biased towards Twerk and the Goonies. But like I said before, could you blame him? I mean, he managed Twerk. That's his client. You can't ask a manager to go against his client or he's going to get fired. Now, his platform is URL bias. Yes, that's who he up under. That's who he do errands and, and, and work for. I definitely understand that. Is he wrong for that? Yeah, to some degree, he definitely wrong for that. Because if you're going to dress, here's how I feel. If you're going to dress and call people out on this, you got to do it to them too. That's how I feel, regardless to how or uh, who, who, who it is. If you put, if you present yourself out there, like I'm gonna give you an example. 
if we call him biased and he's saying no, then he is entitled to stand by that and tell the truth about that. You can't say you're not biased when it comes to the URL, but you're not addressing URL things that, thing that they do wrong. You can't say you're not biased to a battle rappers in top tier when you're not addressing what uh, PG's and them doing wrong and things like that. So I definitely understand where this can be going. I definitely see see exactly what J Boom mean, man. You know, I think uh, I think I think you on both sides of the fence. It's like if you want the people to ride with you, I ain't biased. But if I don't want the people to ride with me, then I am biased. But you can't say you not, but then you're moving like you is. And you can't say you is, and you're moving like you not. It's not my judgment, though. We're going to see what the people got to say. Um, did he try to murder battle rap? I think he tried to do some things that... Uh, some things hit, some things missed. Some things hit, some things missed. Do y'all believe he tried to murder battle rap? Do y'all believe he tried to murder battle rap and that he should be charged with um, attempted murder for all the different things he did did that was suspect into like tearing down and sabotaging people's names and brands? In leagues, do y'all believe he should be charged with attempted murder for battle rap on battle rap? I leave the rest up to y'all to decide. Jake Boone bought the case up before the Battle Truth Court. In this case, uh, this case was passed. Um. 7 to 12. This case was passed 7 to 12. So, I leave the rest up to y'all to decide. This your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment that's in question. It's yours. Is wrong guilty of assault, attempt, uh, attempted murder on Battle Rap. Let's talk about it.